take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Despite the diuretic effect of caffeine, both herbal and caffeine-containing teas are unlikely to dehydrate you. To have a significant diuretic effect, caffeine needs to be consumed in amounts greater than 500 mg, or the equivalent of 6 to 13 cups, 1440 to 3120 milliliters of tea. 7, 8.13 March 2019. Take our lead. Though moderate intake is healthy for most people, drinking too much could lead to negative side effects, such as anxiety, headaches, digestive issues, and disrupted sleep patterns. Most people can drink 3 to 4 cups, 710 to 950 milliliters, of tea daily without adverse effects, but some may experience side effects at lower doses. 26 November 2019. Let's help you make your mark. Foods and drinks that dehydrate you. Sodium is a big culprit. When you eat salty foods, your cells tell your brain that you're thirsty. Sugary drinks also contribute. Much like salty foods, sugary drinks also tell your brain that you're thirsty. Blueberries, fatty fish, soy, fiber, tea, calcium-rich foods. The 30th of January 2013. Make your mark, take our lead. Herbal teas Herbal teas such as hibiscus tea, rose tea or chamomile tea are great hydrating drinks for winters. They are natural and caffeine-free, so you don't have to worry. They not only help in keeping you hydrated but also calm your tired nerves and relax your mind. Point one one January 2021. Let's help you make your mark. Avoid stone-forming foods, beets, chocolate, spinach, rhubarb, tea, and most nuts are rich in oxalate, which can contribute to kidney stones. If you suffer from stones, your doctor may advise you to avoid these foods or to consume them in smaller amounts. Point three one August 2020. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.